Hi, it's Lee Giles from Easy Peasy Element Homeschool. Wanted to show you my little poster I have hanging up on our miracle wall. Um, if you've listened to our miracle stories, all those stories have a little mini display and index card with like some description in the year and the place on it and lots of little tokens hanging up with the cards. A little picture demonstrating what it is. And some are just small index cards just a word answers to prayer. Um, we have cork, four cork boards that go across the wall of our dining room. Anyway, on the last cork board, I have this hanging up. This is what I would tell people when I got the chance. Uh, someone who was willing to hear such things. Um, let's just say 2020 and 2021. You know what I'm talking about? Um, this is what I would tell them to show them there's no need to worry. Like when I would think about stuff going on, I couldn't find a reason for concern. I wish that was always the case. Um, I did not hang this up in 2021 because I didn't need it. I knew this and it was easy for me. <laughs> when I hung this up was when my oldest son started adventuring. Um, he's 20 and started going out on adventures on his own. Um, he never, he's never even spent the night at someone's house. He's never <laughs> been away. And then all of a sudden he spent a week in Costa Rica and didn't have cell phone access and went on another trip and lost his passport and <laughs> another trip and was in like negative 15 degree <laughs> weather. He's adventurous. I'm going to climb a volcano today kind of kid. And I'm going to be out in the middle of nowhere and I won't have have self-service for a few days. You won't hear from me. He traveled recently for 21, 25 days. Drove all the way across the country, made it to California from Philadelphia, where we are, and went to all sorts of places, which is amazing. He saw the Grand Canyon. I've never seen it. Um, and it's, it's awesome. And I trust the Lord is uh, training him up for his exciting, daring mission work to come. Um, but yes, he is the reason I hung this up, <laughs> so that I could just remind myself. So, here we go. God is powerful, so he is able. So I'd ask people, well, do you believe God's powerful? Do you believe he's all-powerful? Of course, you know. Well, then he's able to act, right? He's able to do something about it. God is love. So I would ask people, do you believe God's loving? You know, of course. Of course people say yes. All right, so he cares, right? So he cares about what's going on, and he's able to do something about it. Um, God is sovereign. So, you know, then you ask, well, is God sovereign? Do you believe he's in control? Or does he have to bow to someone else's wishes? <laughs> someone else putting demands on him and what he can and can't do. So, yes, of course God's in control. He's sovereign overall, right? What he says has to happen. <laughs> it's in your Bible puts out his hand. Who can turn it back? I'm sorry if I was talking too quietly. So, he's able, and he, he cares about what's going on, and he's able to do something about it. He has the authority to do something about it. So no one can tell him you can't do it. He has the authority to make the decision to act on what he's caring about. And then, God is good. So I say, well, do you believe God is good? Of course, people know this, right? God is good all the time. Well, if he's good, then we can trust his will. We can trust what he is sovereignly going to do because of how he cares for us. So, where is the place for worry? <laughs> now, we never did get sick and we never did do anything at all <laughs> to protect ourselves. Sometimes I would purposely do the opposite. I would purposely not wash my hands if I had the thought like I should because I wouldn't let fear control me. Fear doesn't get to make the decisions. Controlled by the Holy Spirit. So, yeah, I just like take my kids, let's go play and touch everything and then I'll wash my hands just to stick it to fear. So, that's how I treated it. <laughs> and we never did get sick. And I was sort of believing that everyone gets sick. You're, he 
he's our protection. We weren't trying to protect ourselves. We were relying on him for protection. We didn't wipe anything down, you know. We were relying on him for protection. He's the stronghold. He's the shield. <laughs> he's the fortress. He's our strong deliverer. He is able. He cares. He's sovereign. He could do something about it. And I can trust his will, but I can trust his will. So I knew if we did get sick, he allowed it for because because he cares, because he loves me. And there was some good purpose in it that he chose that for us. So, yay, I want his good purposes working out in my life. His good purpose isn't ease and comfort. His good purpose is the life of Christ manifests in us, his life alive in us so we can live forever. He wants eternal life in us now and forever. That's what I want working in my life. That's what he wants to work in my life. He wants to bless me so I could be a blessing to others. The life of Christ, the spirit flowing rivers, right? Not just coming into us, but coming out of us. That's what he's working out. I want his good purposes, what he's choosing. That's what I want. So let it be to me according to your will. Anyway, and I have I do have a general belief that God's will in general is health, healing, wholeness, you know, having what you need, all the stuff that God provides. Um, not that we never get colds or anything ever, but we can trust Him. He takes care of us. So I wrote at the bottom. What's my response? Just to help my brain. Those times when it, too many thoughts are coming and you just need help getting your brain thinking the right way. Our job is to trust, give thanks, humble ourselves, wait with rejoicing. So that give thanks, humble ourselves, wait with rejoicing. It's a, a, a big thing that I talk about in the new September study coming out September 2022 called The Suffering Servant on the All One Homeschool site. So maybe that will help you. So there you go. God is able. God cares. He has authority, so we can trust as well. So what's there to be concerned about?